Being a champion to me means, first of all, winning, but winning with class, being humble, and sharing the love with your teammates because no one person is bigger than a team. Being a champion to me means uh, putting forth all the effort that you had, you know, anything that you do. You know, Coach Fish always says everybody likes a champion, everybody loves a, a humble champion. You could really feel that there was an X on our back, even at the beginning of the season too, not just at the end. Uh, just, just knowing that the fact that we had to come in week in, week out, and just uh, find, vic find ways to get victories, uh, there was definitely a difference of uh, feeling between two years ago and last year. I thought we had an outstanding season, particularly how we started off uh, one and two, very difficult schedule. And I just think our guys did a phenomenal job of, of staying focused, and, you know, being tough-minded week after week after week. You know, we had so much fun, and it was, it was so much excitement throughout the season. You know, we had uh, so many times, I mean, we, we had lost a couple of games and we had to bounce back. So, uh, you know, we just band together and we, and we got to the playoffs and, you know, we just took it one game at a time. That was the most exciting thing for, for me. One of our things that we do great around here is you know, going one game at a time and, and not looking back and not looking forward. And Our guys did a super job of that. The Baylor game, because it's the second game of the season. I mean, we're going back to Baylor again. We played pretty good. I mean, we had them beat. That's how I knew that we was going to have another great year. Probably that run we made from after the UCA game on is the best football that we've played here. And, you know, I believe we you know, outscored our opponents an average of you know, 45 to, to 10. Really complete domination from that point on. When we went to go play Northwestern State, there was no doubt in all of our minds what we had at stake with the conference championship two years in a row. We knew, we knew coming to that game, we was gonna have a fight on our hands and just everybody was mentally prepared and all the way up until the game and, and it showed Come kickoff, you know, we, we kind of came out and played our game with them and, and took a lead, and then the rest was history. My highlight of the year was going to the Montana State game, just going in there, playing well offensively, grinding out a win in a really, really, really tough environment, and just uh, uh, playing good, pulling close as a team, and uh, grinding out a victory. It was the real big thing, just focusing and just knowing that we had the opportunity and to, uh, to go out and do something that, hasn't, that has never been done at this university and that was to repeat uh, two times as back-to-back uh, you know, -back, uh, conference champions. And one of our goals this season was to be a perennial power in a, uh, FCS football and be one of those teams that, that people talk about year in and year out. And uh, I feel like we've, we've accomplished that. And, uh, you know, we had a great season in 2011, and we wanted to back that up with another great season in 2012 and the last thing we wanted to be was a one-hit one. -hit and uh, knowing that you gave everything that you had into something uh, and you put forth continuous effort and uh, strive for the best, uh, that's a champion.